Uh, for Christians, how much does it help or not help to try and speak encouraging biblical truth to a Christian person suffering from depression? How can we say these things without sounding self-righteous or preachy? Um, <laughs> by doing so with humility, <laughs> maybe it's the most straightforward answer. I mean, that, that, that's, that's, that's a very... Um, Acknowledging that, uh, understanding that some of the capacities um, for uh, receiving that truth might be broken, um, and that's okay. That, that, like I said, the prefrontal cortex or certain parts of it might literally be dis disconnected. So in a sense, it's like showing somebody a, a, you know, a printed Bible who's blind and saying, look, it's in the black and white. And it's like, well, yeah, I can't read, I'm blind. Um, and so for people with depression, that, that sometimes with what these biblical truths, the ability to comprehend truth cognitively about a hopeful future um, isn't necessarily intact. And so this is why um, I, I said that the sitting with friends, listening, um, the emotional side might not be broken yet, um, or to the extent to which it's only partially broken, yeah, share the biblical truths. Um, how do you do it without sounding self-righteous or preachy? Well, acknowledging that they might not, that, that, that they might not be believing the biblical truth because it's because of because of a disorder it might not be their fault um so if you're preaching um it's the, the implication is that there's some sort of um moral thing that could be amended or changed and that might not be the case um be open to the possibility that they, they can't comprehend that particular biblical truth at that particular time even if it is a biblical even if the fact that they can't their their non-comprehension doesn't make it any less true so um you know, share it with humility. Um, but there's plenty of, but then also recognize that, you know, there, but for the grace of God, go I, there is no biblical truth that you understand that is because of your own righteousness. So, uh, you know, thank God that you can understand biblical truth that you can, 